travel, you learn. Hardest part of traveling, though. Anyone been out of the country recently? Anyone been out of the country recently? Where'd you go? Where'd you go? Dubai. There you go. Dubai. Oh, my God. Do you remember what the exchange rate was between the dollar and the, uh, it was a, uh, the dirham? 3.67. Wow. Yeah, there you go. Exactly. That's the hardest part of traveling is this exchange rate. It's never like 1 to 5 or 1 to 10. It's never the basic math that you learn in school. It's always 1 to 3.67. Who's doing that math? Right? If they say $8, uh, 8 times 3.67. Let me see here. 8 times carry the 3.67 divided by 4. and the... It's confusing. Anytime I go anywhere, I have no idea what I'm spending the first week. I feel like you give them dollars, they give you Monopoly money. I have no idea what, I went to Lebanon, I gave the guy $100, he gave me 53,000 Lebanese pounds. I thought he messed up. Yeah, I called my wife, we're rich, we're rich. <laughs> buy the furniture, buy the furniture. Don't worry how I got the money, just buy the furniture. Yeah, buy a chandelier too, why not, buy a chandelier. <laughs> Next day I went to buy some gum, the guy goes, that'll be 52,000 Lebanese pounds. I call my wife, we're broke, we're broke. Return the furniture. Gum is expensive in Lebanon. Didn't know we had a gum embargo in Lebanon. The most confusing part of traveling though is the tipping. Some places you're supposed to tip. Some places you're not. Some places it's an insult. Like I think that when you check in at passport control, this should tell you the tipping rules. Right, you show up in Australia, right? Welcome to Australia. Down under, we don't tip, but if you like your food, wrestle your wider. <laughs> By the way, if there's any Australians, I know that's the worst Australian accent ever. I just kind of do pirate whenever I do ar, 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 Australia. Ar, 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 ar. <laughs> it's very. Di I went to Sweden. In Sweden, you're not supposed to tip. It's an insult when you tip. I tried to tip over there, and when they say no in Swedish, they say nay. Nay, it's right? It sounds very Shakespearean, nay. I went over to the waitress, I go, here you go. She goes, nay, nay. I was like, uh, to be or not to be? I tried again, she goes, nay, nay. I go, wherefore art thou? I thought she wanted to do some Shakespearean improv. I don't know. Someone goes, you idiot. She doesn't want the tip. I go, I'm sorry. Some places, exact opposite. In Dubai, I went to Dubai. There's a lot of Indians in Dubai. A lot of them are day laborers. They don't get paid that well. There's this one Indian guy who cleaned my hotel room and I tipped him the equivalent of $10. I think I paid his mortgage for the month. Because the rest of my stay, every time I would come out of my room, this guy would pop out from behind a different plant and offer to clean my room again. Every time I just say, hey, hello, sir. Can I clean your room again, sir? I go, Sanji, if you already said, I would like to do it again, please, sir. I go, Sanjeev, the room is very clean. Sir, I want to make it very, very clean, very, very clean. I go, Sanjeev, calm down. He goes, sir, I've been thinking about your room all night. I have ideas for your room, sir. Sir, please, give me one opportunity. Just one opportunity, 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 one opportunity, just one opportunity, just one opportunity, one opportunity, two opportunity, upper opportunity, three opportunity, four opportunity, upper opportunity, yeah. It became a Bollywood movie. His cousins came out of nowhere. Upper opportunity, give him opportunity. One opportunity, two opportunity, 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 opportunity. Oh, one opportunity, upper opportunity, three opportunity, four opportunity. <laughs> two hour Bollywood movie. <laughs> it's like, all right, clean the room. Sometimes they're so appreciative, they will bring you a gift from their home in appreciation. Sir, I would just like to say that I appreciate you. Sir, I would just like to so show my appreciation to you. Sir, I would just like to tell you I'm appreciative of you. Sir, in India we have a saying. When you appreciate someone, you appreciate them. <laughs> it is much more poetic in Hindi. <laughs> In English, it's rather shitty, really. It doesn't work. <laughs> anyway, sir, I just want to tell you, sir, I bought a gift from me to you, sir. From me to you, from my home to you, from me to you, from my home to you, from me to you, from my home to you, from me to you, from my home to you, sir. Here are my wife and children. Please take them. <laughs> just give them one opportunity, upper opportunity, three opportunity, lower opportunity, upper.